Welcome back, guys. I could not resist doing this story. The incredible journey of El Farolito, a small but mighty club from San Francisco that made the headlines in this year's US Open Cup. So El Farolito are an amateur team who are deeply rooted in the local community. They stunned the world of American soccer by knocking out professional teams in the US Open Cup last month. Today we explore their journey, the secrets behind their unexpected success and how their story recently came to a close. So a bit of history first. Founded in 1985 by Salvador Lopez, El Farolito is named after a beloved local taqueria, a place as much about community as it is about delicious burritos. El Faro is Spanish for lighthouse. Lighthouses or faros symbolise stability and direction something El Farolito holds true to its heart. This club isn't new to the spotlight. It made waves back in 1993 by winning US Open Cup under the name Club Deportivo Mexico. The team normally play and train just once a week, unless they're knocking out pro teams in the Open Cup. And their chief, Santiago Lopez, who inherited the burrito joint from his father, imposes a strict no-train, no-play rule on his players. These players range in age from 18 to 36, and there's not a professional player amongst them. The team is made up of construction workers, Uber Eats drivers, engineers and college students, all of whom had to give their all for their, for their success, including some gruelling journeys to and from San Francisco. One standout of the team is Honduran Dembo Benson, whose performances have been nothing short of heroic and have been punctuated by his memorable celebrations. Under the guidance of their skilled coach and the spirit of the community, every player is stepping up when it counts. So fast forward to 2024 and El Farolito is re reliving its glory days. They've already caused major upsets, including a dramatic win against Portland Timbers' second team. With a team that blends young talents and experienced leaders, they're proving that passion and teamwork can defy the odds. The success of El Farolito is testament to the vibrant soccer culture in San Francisco's Mission District. Each match they've played seems like more than a game. It's a community event that brings everyone together, celebrating their heritage and love for soccer. Despite their fantastic journey, El Farolito's run in the US Open Cup came to the end at the hands of Oakland Roots, a professional team that proved to be a formidable opponent. This match, while marking the end of the year's dream run, adds to the lore of El Farolito's fighting spirit and the deep connection they share with their fans. As El Farolito continues to compete and grow, all eyes will be on this remarkable team to see how they evolve and continue to inspire. Will they make another deep run in the future? One thing's for sure, this San Franciscan team is going to have many more fans than it did last year. What do you think about this incredible run? Who else can do this sort of thing? Can they come back stronger next season? Share your thoughts below. I'll see you next time.